All right, this is a TBS Unify Evo, and I'm going to follow this flowchart from the manual to unlock it. Um, just powered it up, and you can see because there is a blue LED, it is in the locked state. If it had a blue and a red or orange LED, that would tell us it was unlocked. And um, if you can't go above 25 milliwatts or you can't go to certain channels, that is why. So here I'm going to show you how to unlock the TBS Unify Pro 32 Evo. I think this is pretty much the same for the other Pro 32 uh, video transmitters. What we're going to need to do is enter the menu by holding down the button for three seconds. Um, on older Unifies, you may be used to holding down the button and waiting for the red light to turn on. The uh, Evo doesn't seem to do that. So if I hold down the button, the red light goes out. And then the blue light comes back on, and I can't really tell what's happening now. It's why well, I broke it. I have no idea what just happened. I think we switched pit mode on or off. Yeah, I think we're putting it into it and taking it out of pit mode. I'm not sure about that, but anyway, let's do it. I'm gonna hold this down for three seconds till the red light goes out, and now we get single red, single blue. Single red means channel select mode. Single blue means channel one. We're gonna do it again. And two reds means band select mode. And single blue, I have to look it up, but means A band. Okay, fine. Uh, and now we are gonna hold this button down for 30 seconds and that will unlock the video transmitter. Now the LED is gonna do some stuff, but I'm gonna hold it down for 30 seconds. So yeah, just sit with me here. It goes off, it starts blinking, it hasn't been 30 seconds yet. About 10 seconds so far, 15 seconds. Doing some nonsense, I don't know what's going on. For 20 seconds. It should be about 30 seconds here. I'm waiting for the LED to do something. Okay, I think it's definitely been 30 seconds. I'm gonna let go. And now it goes one, two, three, one. Three reds is power select, one is 25 milliwatts. If we're unlocked, we should be able to just quick press the button and shift to a higher output power. Ready? One, two, three, one, two. Now here's what's different about the Pro 32 and the Evo. If we hold the button down for three seconds, we move forward in the menu. Look at this menu. There's all these things we can change. There's so many parameters to change that they don't want to make you go all the way through to get out and save your settings. So if we hold down for three seconds, we go to the next menu item that we might want to change. If we hold down for five seconds, we save and exit. So let's hold down for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, and when that blue light comes back on, I think that's the save and exit. Okay, perfect. So we've got the blue, it's a little hard for the camera to pick it up, but the blue and the orange LED are on at the same time. It kind of actually looks like a, a single purple LED. They're so close together, but trust me, that tells you that it's unlocked. 